My neighbor's cat stuck in the tree. I forgot to tell you guys about that. There's a cat outside that's meowing like crazy. And it's stuck in the tree like... Uh, it doesn't know how to get down. What a dumb fucking idiot. It's been in the tree for six days. <laughs> what kind of a dumb fucking cat does that? She called the fire department and they won't come over. She's like 70 and they told her... Thank you. That's just in the movies, kid. <laughs> She's like 70. Or maybe 60. I don't know. Whatever. Uh, anyway, this cat's up in the tree, and every time anyone tries to get near it, it goes higher up in the tree. What a, what a dummy. It's eventually gonna get hungry and come down. But that's another thing. I like to... You know me, I like to uh, observe nature. Thanks, everybody. I told you guys about the birds outside. Oh, I told you about the cat too, right? It's still in the tree. Unbelievable. I saw it was trying to get... I think... Okay, you know, I think that that cat... See, my neighbor thinks that the cat's been stuck in the tree for six days, right? And I, I'm not going to argue with her, you know? I'm just being a nice neighbor and making small talk, right? But I think the cat comes down every night and fucking does whatever the hell it wants. And then it just goes back up there. How could it be up there for six days? It's not possible. There's no way it's going to get hungry. But she's, she's sure of it. And the thing that makes her think that it's stuck there is because it's an inside cat. There are outside cats that are like Himalayan white cats. But this is an inside cat. So she thinks that it escaped from her house and it got spooked and went up the tree. But I don't know. How could that be possible? When, how long is it going to be able to be up there? You know? It can't be possible. It has to come down. I mean, I haven't seen it myself. But it's up there now. It's like fucking around with birds. Because, you know, birds don't think there's going to be a cat in this tree. So they'll fucking land in the tree. And then they'll get spooked like crazy. Could you imagine that? If you're a bird, you land in a tree and there's like a cop. What's, what is this cop doing here? What, is, what are you doing here? Oh, that's fucked up if you're a bird. That cat's really getting even. Birds, they got it made. Anyway, the whole point I brought this up was because those birds flew away but in the game. Keep talking <coughs> shit about my cat butterfly. Hey, thanks. Uh, your next door neighbor. Mm, what was I saying? Oh yeah, the birds. We have genius birds here too. There's genius birds that the ones that got scared by the cats in the tree. Those genius birds, they take the nuts from across the street in the tree. They take the nuts off of the tree. I saw this shit with my own eyes. Okay? I saw it. It's not something I heard about. The fucking birds get the nut off the tree. They take it and fly it into the street. And they leave it there. And then they fly out to the tree. And they just fucking sit there until a car drives by and smashes the nut. And then they eat it. Have you ever heard of this shit? I couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe it. It's unbelievable. How do they know that? What else do they know? That's the question. If they know that, they know more than that. That's not all they know. That's how they eat. You know? That's just how they eat. They know too much. These birds know way too much, which is why I like the idea of the cat going in the tree and teaching them who's boss. You think you know, but some cats live in trees, bitch. So, I don't know. It's a little bit sketchy out there. Cats and trees, birds know how to open up coconuts, regular nuts. Yeah, I was pretty impressed with those birds. I'll be honest. Thank you. I was pretty impressed. I mean, dogs are supposed to be so smart. 
And they would never figure out how to do that. No way. I really love your stream, man. I'm gonna count that as a question. Anyway, I really love streaming. So that works out pretty well. But just because it works out so well Thanks. doesn't mean we have to communicate. Bird watching goes both ways. Hey, all right, birds aren't real. You mean they're watching me? I mean, how the fuck else could they have gotten so smart without watching me? Obviously, they're watching me. Who knows what else they've learned? They must have picked up some other strats. They're probably hella good at video games. Thanks, birds aren't real in Prism. Thanks for the tier two, Prism. Like me. They won't come. They won't get it out of the tree. I mean, I don't blame them. You know how many cats there are? You know, a fire, fire truck is for fires. I don't blame them. But, anyway. YouTube, man, doesn't that suck? I feel like everything I say, I gotta watch out because No Pants is gonna turn that shit into dinner. You know? Every other word. I can't say anything in this town without that shit turning into a fucking YouTube video around here. You know that? Shit's mad annoying. If you, you know, I hope you guys appreciate that damn uh, YouTube channel because it's a, it's a thorn. You know that? 